The standard method for entering the BIOS setup utility is to tap a specific function key while the computer is booting. The required key is either F1 or F2, depending on the model of the machine. Certain systems also require holding down the FN key while tapping the F1 or F2 key. If the color of F1 through F12 is orange or blue, then holding the FN key is required to enable the function keys. However, if the color of F1 through F12 on the keyboard is white, holding the FN key is not required. Sometimes the computer will boot too quickly to use the standard method for entering the BIOS setup utility. In this case, the operating system can be configured to enter BIOS upon restart. To access the advanced startup settings in Windows 8, open the charms bar by pointing to the upper right corner of the screen with a mouse cursor, or bring it up by pressing the Windows key and the C key at the same time. On a touch screen, open the charms bar by swiping in from the right edge of the screen. Once the charms bar is open, click on settings, then select change PC settings from the menu. Click on update and recovery, then select recovery to advance to the next step. Choose Restart Now under the Advanced Startup heading to bring up a menu with several options. Select Troubleshoot from the menu and then click Advanced Options. Click UEFI Firmware Settings, then select Restart. The system will now boot into the BIOS setup utility. To open the Advanced Startup Settings in Windows 10, open the Start menu and then click on Settings. Click on Update and Security, then select Recovery to advance to the next step. Choose Restart Now under the Advanced Startup heading to bring up a menu with several options. Select Troubleshoot from the menu and then click Advanced Options. Click UEFI Firmware Settings, then select Restart. The system will now boot into the BIOS setup utility.